Hey guys, it's Coach here and welcome to episode 6 of Building Bayern, the uh, series where we're trying to get ourselves uh, one of the best Bayern Munich teams on the game that we can. But uh, as you can see, we do now have 16 um, players or Bayern Munich players in the, the team. We just need two more to be able to fill up that bench and uh, obviously the starting 11 has already been filled up. But uh, hopefully in this episode we can carry on the successful strike force partnership of uh, Shakiri and Lewandowski. Hopefully we can carry on our winning streak because we, uh, we're on a decent streak at the moment so... Um, Hopefully we can carry that on, um, but as you can see, we're going to start off by opening our weekly pack. It has been a week since we did episode one or two since we opened our last weekly pack, and unfortunately, as you uh, as as of obviously, it's there's going to be nothing in the pack pretty much because it is a 5k pack. Sometimes you get a decent ones. Um, I did get a free pack on my other account recently where I did actually get in from uh, Sergio Busquets, um, but that was because I was opening loads of packs at once, so that I got a bit lucky there. But as you can see from the divisions, um, we have played three games in Division 8 so far, and we have won three, which is brilliant, and uh, hopefully uh, in this episode we can get promoted. Uh, the title of the video will probably be Division 8 title, question mark, etc. So, uh, so we go into the first game and uh, we come up against another Bundesliga team. Uh, I think we come up against two or three of those recently. Um, but uh, as you can see, we go 1-0 down. A really nice goal from Aubameyang. Poor defending from myself, to be honest. Um, let him run all the way through my team. Uh, but we equalise within uh, within a couple of minutes. Uh, Shakiri getting on the score sheet once again. And then Banasha with some nice work from a short corner. And Lewandowski with a lovely towering header to make it 2-1 in the, the 21st minute. And from then on, it was kind of... Um, Contro well, we just controlled the game really well. Muller here getting himself on the score sheet. I'm pretty sure it's one of his first... I don't know whether it's his first goal, but I'm pretty sure it's... Uh, he hasn't got a few, he hasn't got many goals for us uh, recently. So, um, hopefully he can step that up. But uh, he scored to make it 3-1. And then Lewandowski assists Shakiri once again to make it 4-1 in the 37th minute. And a nice finish from Shakiri. Let it come across his body and uh, put it around the keeper. But, uh, unfortunately, we get another rage quit, um, which is annoying because we don't get as many coins. But it does mean that we do get another three points on the board in the division. Meaning that we do now need three points uh, from our remaining, I believe, six games uh, to get ourselves the title of Division 8. But uh, we do make uh, us the signing, uh, well, the only signing of this episode is going to be Sebastian Rode. Um, unfortunately, it's not an exciting signing, but the reason I wasn't, well, I would have brought Goetze, um, but his upgraded card has come out. So what I'm going to do is, um, this is the last episode I'm making um, before I go away for the February half term. So, um, so... Um, when I get back, hopefully Gertz's price will be around 15, 20,000 coins. So I will pick him up after that. Um, his upgraded 86 card looks absolutely brilliant. But uh, yeah, Sebastian Rode is a really nice card to um, to have. He's a really solid uh, replacement for Xabi Alonso. Um, obviously, when we get the likes of uh, Lahm and Schweinsteiger in the team, um, Rode will probably miss out a bit. But then eventually, when we get Team of the Year, Team of the Year Lahm into the team. Obviously, he's going to be at right back, um, and he's going to be our main right back. So, Rode maybe maybe play maybe probably one in ten games, something like that. Um, but he's going to be one of those players that's only there in case of emergency, etc. But uh, for now, he's a good replacement for Xabi Alonso, and uh, as you can see, he's, he's playing all right. I think he got an assist for that goal there, um, a nice cross in, and I think Lewandowski got his head on it. It might have been Visa or Rode, I'm not too sure. But uh, as you can see, some uh, poor defending from myself once again. Um, to let the guy get back into the game to make it 2-1. We managed to make it 3-1. Nice, uh, really nice finish from uh, from Lewandowski. And he's such a class player. Um, I'm really glad we got him into the team early because he's definitely helping us out in these lower divisions. Obviously, I'm not struggling too much, but... Um, he definitely helps out, and uh, him and Shakiri are an awesome strap partnership. And as you can see, both of them getting on the score sheet in that game. We managed to win the game 3-2. Actually, did have to hung, uh, hang on towards the end. Uh, uh, Dumbia getting himself uh, a few goals, uh, two goals, I think. Um, but uh, as you can see, we did win the title because we won that game 3-2. And uh, just to um, refresh your guys' memories, um, as you can see, because of that division title, we are actually going to be getting two packs. Now, uh, with those two packs, I'm not actually going to open them in this episode. I'm going to store them in a little bank. We did this last year where uh, if I won a title, so I did get 100,000 coins, but I stored that in the bank a few times. Um, so what, I, what I'm, I'm tempted to do is every time I win a title from now, just save up those packs until um, possibly team of the season comes around because we could build up to maybe 10, 12 packs, something like that, which could be quite cool uh, around team of the season time because obviously there's going to be more players that we can pack, uh, more uh, expensive players that we could sell on for more coins than we can at the moment. But as you can see, we're going to the third and final game of the episode. And we do actually come up against a guy with a... 
full bronze English team, and it was really strange to come up against this guy in Division 7, um, considering it's, it's it's not a low division, and he, to be fair, he wasn't a bad opponent. Um, usually people with that, that with that sort of team that go into divisions are good, but our team was a bit too strong uh, for him, and we managed to win the game 3-0. But yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching the episode. If you have enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. Uh, make sure to leave in the comment section below whether you'd like to see me by Goethe or another upgraded player. It's your guys' choice, but obviously, uh, think about we only have around 80k, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time.